Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Cassandra. Today I have a review and this review is on Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. So if you want to see exactly what I think about this fragrance, please continue to watch. Okay, we are back. And this is the packaging that the fragrance came in. All you have to do is just open it up. And this is what it looks like. Gorgeous packaging. I love the packaging on this one. Okay. Just take the bottle out. And this is the gorgeous bottle. Now this is a, let me see, this is a 100 milliliters, 3.4 fluid ounce. Gorgeous, y'all. Simply gorgeous. Coco Mademoiselle. I love the bottle. Look at this bottle, y'all. Made like a dime. I just love the way they, um... Chanel does their um, bottles. This is a gorgeous bottle. And then it has the um, name Coco Mademoiselle uh, with this little um, tag on it. I don't know if you want to call it a tag or what you want to call it. But it's in gold and the writing is in silver or just clear. I don't know what you'll say it. And embossed in something. Then around the neck of it, which is white, it also have the symbol CC in gold. And you see the gold up around the neck. And then you see this clear top. And it does have some weight to it. And then the neck of the itemizer is gold itself. With the white sprayer sticking out. Okay. Now, this fragrance was launched in 2001. Okay. Let's give it a spray. Did y'all see that spray on that? Love the spray. Love it. Now I'm going to put the correct notes over here somewhere. But I'm just going to tell you what I smell. Now. In this fragrance. Y'all yeah, this smells so good. Mm, mm, mm. I definitely smell oranges. I smell orange blossoms. I smell some jasmine peeking through. I smell some bergamot. And I definitely smell some roses in this fragrance, y'all. Mm. Patchouli. Oh. Yeah, this is so gorgeous. This is definitely a citry, florally, powdery fragrance, y'all. And it's spicy. You definitely can smell spices in this. This is a very classy, mature fragrance. Not old lady. Not old lady. This is just a mature woman fragrance not the little childish thing not like for a little tina bumper no this is a mature woman mature woman this is so classy and sexy this reminds me of richness a woman that got it all together a woman that got her coins together a woman that knows how to dress and come and step in a room y'all that's the type of woman I smell with this fragrance, y'all. Mmm, it smells so good. And this fragrance, y'all, it lasts. It lasts a long time. On my skin, when I was wearing this, it lasts eight plus hours. And don't even mention the siage on this. This siage, you come in the room, they know you was in there. You go out of the room, they smell y'all down the hall. 
And and like I said, I'm an oversprayer, but I didn't overspray the first two days I wore this, y'all. Mm -mm. And I'm here to tell you. People kept saying, well, what you got on? That smells so good. That smells so good. And my husband was like, mm. Mm. He knew what I had on because he purchased it. So, of course, he knew. But, y'all, this is so sexy and classy. Sexy and classy. Mm. 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 Oh, the patchouli in this. Mm. I love this fragrance, y'all. This fragrance is epic. Epic, epic, epic. I mean, Coco Mano Mosaic. I did not know this fragrance smelled this good and it lasts like that. I did not know that. Mm. Where have I been? Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, let's go ahead on and rate this fragrance, okay? On a scale from one to five, the packaging, gorgeous, simply gorgeous, we gave it a five. On a scale from one to five, the bottle, a five. On a scale from one to five, the um, atomizer, a five. On a scale from one to five, the juice inside this bottle, a five. On a scale from one to five, the CR, the longevity, hmm, a five. A five, y'all. My overall number for this epic fragrance is a five. Yes, this is epic, 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 epic. I mean, the last couple of fragrances I've been getting is epic. Who would have known? And y'all know, it, I, I don't just throw that epic out there. Y'all know that. But this... It's epic. What else can I say? But it's epic. You can wear it anytime. Morning, noon, nighttime, all season. This is gorgeous, y'all. Simply gorgeous. And I don't think it is unisex. I think it's more feminine than anything. But hey, boo, you do you. If you bought it and you're a guy, you wear it. Wear it, baby. Show them you can wear it. Yes. Like I always say, all fragrances are unisex. You wear what you want to wear. You wear what you want to wear. You wear what you want to wear. Yes. That's you. Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. It's a five. Well, that's it for this video. Comment in the bottom section of the video and let me know, do you have Chanel Coco Mademoiselle? Or do you have the intense version? Or do you have any Chanel's? Because a lot of people say they old folks, but you know, like I said, the two Chanel's I get, I love them. I don't know if they old for what I don't, I don't know. I'm not getting into that. I'm just telling you how it smells to me. And it doesn't smell old folks fragrance. It doesn't smell like an old person fragrance. It smells classy, elegant, rich. That's what it smells to me. So comment. Give me your point of view about this fragrance. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And share my videos. I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.